Walk 14, 5 Pitch Trail, Day 5, Newton Link. It's 30th of November 2011, and I fancy a little stroll, again. I've recently done all of the 5 Pitch Trail along with my faithful companion No Names, but I've neglected, like most, to do it in entirety. There's a short section of the 5 Pitch Trail that most people tend to miss out, known as the Newton Link, that connects the trail at Tibshell Ponds with the village of Newton nearby. We'll do that bit. I'm parking the Trekmobile on the road in Newton Village just before the road goes into Blackwall, close to the access point of the trail. As I open the hatchback to release no names, I have to be quick and grab his lead, before he jumps out and starts his usual roaming about dragging his lead. I don't want him doing that here, as we are parked on the road, and we certainly don't want our canine buddy to be run over by any passing vehicles. Within a minute, I've released him, as we access the trail route. I'm fully aware that this will only be a short walk, by comparison to the other previous ones, probably the shortest yet. So I have plans to go for a wander around Silverhill Wood again to get a few more photos when we've finished here. Within minutes, the semi-open grassland of the route has become more a simple surfaced path between two hedgerows, with a horse's field to the right, and open farmland to the left. In no time at all, I am seeing the vehicles and temporary container of a work party on the road to Morton from Tipshelf that we will have to cross to get onto Tipshelf Ponds. So it's back on the lead for no names whilst we meet the road. The workmen are busy constructing a new ramp with a better surface to allow easier access for wheeled means of mobility wheelchairs, bicycles, prams, etc. from the road opposite the old Newton railway station up onto the Silver Hill Trail that meets with the five pitch trail here. The work is not yet complete so the new path cannot be used at present and will need a few days to cure before it will be opened. With access along the new ramp path denied, no names and I are forced to pass under the bridge that carries the Silver Hill Trail and then take a minor on surface footpath on the right to get to Tibshelf Ponds. Within 20 minutes of getting out of the car, we are looking up on Tibshelf Ponds. A few photos later, and we're on our way back. Newton Link tested, and it's fine and well surfaced like the rest of the trails. 20 minutes later, see us back in the Trekmobile and driving towards our next walk of the day at Silver Hill Wood, arriving there at about 2pm. Our five pitch trail walks have now drawn to an end, for now, but we will return soon. Don't forget to view the Newton Link photos on Facebook as usual, and read this post on my blog site. Thank you very much.